My name is Trevor Wesley. And what do we have ourselves here? A list of the collection of knives that I have collected over the past couple of weeks for the COVID-19 zombie apocalypse, just in case any zombies come around. And uh, first knife on the list, we got ourselves a everyday carry Ganzo knife, which is a little flipper. Very convenient, costs around $26. Very affordable, very effective. Next, we have ourselves better quality made knife, which is a bench made, and it is a grip tilling. Little access lock, pop it open, around $80. It's real nice, and if you happen to hit any bone, the access lock won't lock up on you. Recommend it. Next up, we got ourselves a classic grandfather knot that you might want to pass down for generations to come. This is a buck 110, classic. No access lock, but just a traditional folder knot. And uh, it's real quality, sturdy made, great for stabbing. It's real nice. Next, oh yeah, this knife is probably around $100. Next up, we got ourselves a cheap but indestructible knife. Okay, this is a fixed blade, meaning it has no access lock, it just stays there. And I do have a sheath for it, which I will show you. This knife is looks like a steak knife, but it's really more for cut flesh. So uh, it's real nice, it's around $16. Very affordable, very nice. I recommend it for the collection. Last but surely not least, we have ourselves the Buck 120. It's in its sheath now because it is a very dangerous, yet affordable knife. You just pop that right there, pull it out of its sheath. What do we have ourselves here? Very nice blade, classic look, beautiful knife. And uh, perfect for stabbing the uh, zombies, cutting apples, oranges, anything. Nothing in particular, really, just whatever you find yourself using. You can even cut, cut some boxes. But uh, this is just a collection that I recommend. And I don't claim to be an expert on knives. I'm just more of an expert in stabbing. So I'd, I'd like to thank you for joining me. And uh, maybe you'll find yourself purchasing some knives. Thank you very much.